Hey guys, what's going on? It's it's it, and I'm here with a new video showing a game called Minion Masters. So, b basically, what Minion Masters is, it's kind of like a PC version of Clash Royale. Um, as you can see, there's like news about the game oh, what's this? Uh, something mysterious starts in 8 days, that's probably like an event or something um, there's a p power tower which you can get free tokens after a certain amount of hours <coughs> well yeah free tokens after a certain amount of hours to get either shards, gold or rubies so Let's take on one right now, shall we? Let's see what we get. We get some diamonds. Or, yeah, shards even. I can't live. Okay. And there's also power tokens, which you have to buy. Not, um, wait, like, say. 11 hours for a free token. Um, there's some deck building where, as you can see, there's a lot of cards that you can craft using the shards. Like, say, if I wanted to get Mana Puff, I would need 125 shards, and I currently have 140, so I would be able to craft that right now. But say if I had an extra and I wanted to get the shard back f from it, I could click on salvage and it, it would give me the 50 shards back. Well, it, w it would give me 50 shards back even. Um, there's mm, your profile and also achievements and daily quests. Now as you can see that since I just got a achievement, I was able to get an extra 25 shards. Also there's daily quests, play 20 spell cards and you get 100 and, well, 1200 gold, win 5 games with 3 rotation masters and it's 1600 gold and win 10 games and it's 2400 gold. So, oh and also there is the master slash arena selection as you can see I currently have this master right here and oh, this master and also this master are on a free weekly rotation so every week there's different heroes that you can choose from My but I'm going to stay as Stormbringer because I, I, I know him a lot. And also there's different arenas that you can either buy with shards or gems. Or you can, I th think, yeah. I was able to get th this one using, well, to subscribe to Minion Master's YouTube channel, I think it was. You also start off with this one, as you can see, starting arena. <laughs> and I also have access to the classic arena because I was in the early beta, I think. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I said I think, but yeah. Um, there's also solo challenges, kind of like a story mode, um, introing you into the game, a hard level and an expert level. I'm going to do the solo challenges just for this video and then you can kind of get an idea of the game then we'll go into an online game. Da -da -da, click to continue. So I'm on the left side, the bot is on the right hand side. 
So, as you can see, I currently have two minions. He has one, well, had two, but I just killed one of them. And as you can see that these like platforms are blue, that's me getting more experience for my abilities down here. And if he was to have them, then he would get more. And right there, I got a level up. As you can see. Okay. And that's him dead, and I've captured that back. Let's use a fireball. And get rid of that. Deal some more damage. guy and to get our tower back oh he used his ability that was able to swap what was ever on here with here which is annoying right, let's bring out my big guy and there's another one of my abilities Right, so what these can do, as you can see, they have electricity on. Oh, never mind. As you can see, they had like electricity on their lances, so whatever they would hit would be frozen, like stunned, basically. Let's bring out this sniper. You can also, as you can see, use Q, W, E, and R on your keyboard if you want to, like, quick access. Or you can click on them and place them on the field wherever you want them to be. Bring out another sniper. And then let's get some stun lances out. Never mind. Let's get this guy next. He's dead. And the victory is mine. Right, so that's essentially the intro. And then, as I said, there's like a harder tier and then an expert tier. So uh, let's go into online for a match or two. And then. We'll see where the video takes us. And we will be back when I'm finished waiting. And just like that, a match has been found. <laughs> I 
if I go a bit quiet guys, it's because I'm concentrating in the game. Probably screwed. Yep, I'm screwed. That's a bummer. Well, damn it. And I, oh, level 12 reward. I got spell. Okay. Uh, let's see what he's using. Huh. Okay. Let's go with Let's add that card instead. Let's try that out. And oh, never mind. <laughs> I was about to say I'd be back, but apparently I didn't have to go anywhere. Down to potato. Get a nicer. Oh, okay then.
die again. Yep. All because of that one card. Let's see what he had. Oh, he had Colossus. Okay. A legend. Oh, okay. A legendary. 250 damage. And a thousand health. Okay, so he had a few legendaries and supremes. And an Ezekiel was rare. So, that's a bummer. I thought I would have done good, but apparently not. <laughs> uh, let's look at the shop, because I don't think I've showed you guys that. Um, yeah, as you can see, there's a featured offer, double gold, XP boost, rubies, and shards as a premium upgrade. For how much was it? £15. Okay, well, okay. Uh, you, can, you can buy power tokens in quantities of one for a thousand of your gold, two for a hundred and sixty rubies, or ten for seven hundred and twenty five rubies. You can buy rubies for actual money of two pounds for three hundred and twenty five, four pounds for seven hundred and fifty, seven pounds for one thousand six hundred and fifty. Or fourteen pounds for three thousand three hundred and fifty, and then <coughs> wait, I'll go back. And then you'd be able to get more power tokens to get more cards or rubies or shards or anything. Then you can get some. Then you can buy some masters. Volko is either a thousand shards or five hundred and twenty five rubies. Morda is a thousand five hundred shards or seven hundred and seventy five rubies. Ravager is a thousand rubies or five hundred and twenty five so oh, a thousand shards or five hundred and twenty five rubies. Ratbo which is 500 shards or 300 rubies. K King Puff, 1,500 shards or 775 rubies. Come to me, Apep, who we w were killed by two matches ago, I think, which is 500 shards or 300 rubies. And Setsu... A thousand shards or five hundred and twenty five rubies or Milloween, a thousand five hundred shards or seven hundred and seventy five rubies. She was recently added because I haven't seen her at all. <laughs> As you can see, early access, there's some description about the game if you wanted to give you feedback or any issues you had with the game or see the status of the game servers and um yeah i think that's pretty much it so thank you guys for watching and um if you're possibly wanting any more of this then give it a like or a comment saying hey i want I want more of this, this seems like a good game. And I'll produce more video content of it. So, yeah, again, like I said, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!